Hey friends, no, this is not a natural glow. I'm actually sweating my fucking ass off right now because I just did a workout and normally people would make a post-workout protein shake, but I decided I'm gonna make myself my own version of a Wendy's Frosty because <laughs> calories were burned, right? It's actually not that bad. It's actually a healthy Wendy's Frosty. All you're going to need is almond milk, a banana, B. A-N-A-N-A-S, Hershey's cocoa, vanilla, and it says 15 ice cubes. 16, 14, your secret's safe with me. And then we can put them in our tumbler. We need 15 ice cubes. Three fourths cup almond milk, one tablespoon of vanilla, two tablespoons of cocoa powder. I'm like, honestly, nobody has to know that you're not making a protein shake. Just like post-workout, just like be like, hey, yeah, I'm, it's protein. <laughs> Hershey's chocolate, motherfucker. One third of a banana. One. Maybe I'll, I'll put in a little more for good luck. And then we blend. Right, let's have a look-see. So working out after the workout. Put it in our tumbler. Whew, that fits a 20 ounce tumbler perfectly. My straws that I'm obsessed with. Yum! I mean, not quite a Wendy's Frosty, but ours is the healthier version of a Wendy's Frosty. But before I say healthy, is it really even a Wendy's Frosty copy if you don't dip a french fry in it? Does anyone else do that at Wendy's or is it just me? The best combination that life could ever give you. And you guys have a swell day. Hit subscribe and I'll see you guys next week. Are you judging me? And you don't look at me that way.